Hey everyone, and welcome to this video. I am Isabel from the Point of Sale and IoT expertise team. Today, we are diving into a very practical topic for anyone using Odoo Point of Sale, the customer display. What is it? Why does it matter? And how do you set it up the right way? Whether you are running a retail store, cafe, or any customer-facing business, this feature can take your checkout experience to the next level. What is a customer display? It is a secondary screen that faces the customer during checkout. It shows product details, pricing, totals, and even loyalty points in real time. Nice, right? Why is this important? It creates transparency, builds trust, and delivers a modern interactive shopping experience. Let's go over what you actually need to set this up. You can use any device, such as tablet, laptop, even a spare monitor will do, as long as the device can connect via HDMI or USB-C or open a web browser, you are good to go. Today, we are going to use a spare monitor and a tablet. Before we dive in, let's quickly go over a few important settings. There are different ways to connect your customer display. We just need to choose the right one for your point of sale system. Let's walk through it. First, head over to your point of sale, configuration, settings. Here, let's scroll down to the section where we can find this option. Here we have it. We need to make sure that this option is configured properly. It's where it comes the key part. It's where you need to select how it will be connected. It depends on whether you are using it locally, remotely, or via an IoT box. Let's explore each of these options. We are going to start with a local setup. For that, we are going to connect the second screen directly to our point of sale system device with our, our HDMI cable. Now, let's go to the point of sale settings and select how it will be connected. In this case, we will select in the same device. We will save these changes, and that's it. Lastly, we are going to open our session. We will go to here the menu, and we will click on the customer display. A pop-up will come, and we will drag and drop this to our screen. Voila, here we have it. Now, if we select some products, such as, for example, cozy sweater and the poncho, we will see that these ones are directly so to the customers. They are instantly appear on the customer screen. Nice, right? If you want to use a completely separate device for your customer display, let's see how it's done. First, we need to update the configuration in your point of sale settings to enable the display on another device. Let's do that. Let's go back to our configuration settings. Let's scroll down to the option of customer display and let's change it to another device. Voila. Let's save the, play the changes. And now, Let's take our tablet and see it from there. From here, I will open my auto database and in here in the, my point of sale, I will select the three dots on your postcard and select the customer display. This will open my pop-up as a customer display. And now if I enter from my first point of sale and device and select different products, I will easily see that they are added into and they are shown in my customer displays. Quite nice, right? Let's finish the checkout and let's proceed to the payment. Let's say this customer is going to pay by card and let's validate. Really nice, right? It's everything up your life on the display for your customer to view. And the best part of this is like the two devices, they don't even need to be on the same network. Super flexible and super easy. And finally, the third option. If you are using an IoT box, you can connect the customer display directly to it. Let's see how. First, before we dive in, let's make sure everything is connected correctly. Your screen should be plugged into the IoT box. In this case, it's connected with a micro HDMI cable. The IoT box, of course, needs to be connected to your Odoo database and recognized properly. Let's check that. Here we have. If you are not sure how to set the IoT app, no worries, we have you covered. You can check out our dedicated video on connecting your IoT box. 
Don't miss it. Now, let's configure it. Let's head up to our point of sale settings once again, and let's look for our option in here of customer display. In here, we will need to select an IoT connected screen, but before we are going to enable the IoT option, of course, and in here, you see that I already have my display selected. Perfect, this is great. I will save the changes. And now, yes, I will go back to my customer display and I will select an IoT connected screen. Perfect, really good. I will just go now to open our post and add some products to the cart. Of course, before adding the products, I will configure my uh, customer display. In here, I will just click. Of course, I need to turn on my uh, customer display. So in this case, the desktop. Let's give them a time. And here we have it. It's connected. Now, let's add some products to our cart. And as you see, they will show up instantly on the customer facing screen. As simple as that. As you have seen, with just a few steps, you can deliver a police modern checkout experience for your customers. Whether you are using a simple HDMI connected monitor or accessing the display remotely on a tablet. Odoo makes it easy. Once again, thank you for watching and see you in the next one of the